Okay, I'm going to show you the uh, Motorola X Creator. Um, as you can see here, uh, you know, we just got into the Motorola website, and uh, you can choose the Motorola X drop down and click on, you know, there's a lot of options here. There's a lot of options for the Motorola X. Um, accessories, you know, they obviously want to sell you, you know, extra stuff with your phone. It's a great business. Um, and probably the most interesting thing is the Design Yours. So when we click on Design Yours, we'll get a uh, little pop-up here. You can redeem Moto X card, which is you buy it at the AT&T store and you can come here to design it or uh, just play with the Moto Maker, which is what we're going to do. Um, so after you click on that, you're, you're given this uh, screen where you say, you know, kind of gives you make it yours and this get started button. So we can click on get started and you start with uh, this turquoise color. Um, if you click on the 360 option, it will allow you to spin it, which, you know, it's, it's pretty cool. It gives you a little bit of a feel of what the phone's going to look like at all angles. Um, and you can choose different colors. So you have your cool, your neutral, which the woven black kind of gives it a, a carbon fiber-like look, which is which is neat. Um, and warm colors, you know, cherry, uh, lemon lime, which eh, it's a pretty cool looking color, right? Looks kind of like a, a, a Nokia phone. Um, so after you choose your back color, you can go and choose your, your front color, which is just black or white. Um, you know, pretty simple. And you can also choose an access color. You can get metallic blue, silver, black. Um, the blue looks pretty cool with this, I think. Yeah, I think, I think blue looks pretty good. And then you can finally, you know, uh, choose some accessories, right? A snap case, a, uh, um, you know, buy some extra stuff, which, you know, they, they want to sell you more stuff, right? Um, you can also customize some features on the phone. You can add extra internal memory, which is which is good, especially since this doesn't have a micro SD slot. The, you know, 50 bucks, if you're planning on keeping this for a couple of years, for the extra 16 gigs is, is definitely well worth it. Um, uh, you can customize by putting your name on the power on section. So um, you can also change and create like you know some sort of power on signature, which is you know great. You know it's kind of cool. You know customize your phone. Um, you know wallpaper. That's not something hard to change later, but it's neat that for I guess for people that like you know that to just come that way, it feels a little bit more personalized. And you get a, uh, a Google Sync um, account, which is which is pretty cool. They kind of set you up already with uh, 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 you know Google services. Um, it's kind of you know it's kind of cool. They give you an extra 50 gig Google Drive, um, unfortunately for two years. So you know they want to make sure that two years later you're going to buy another you know Motorola phone. And uh, other than that, you can, you know, choose the color of the wall charger, which is, eh, maybe, maybe you want to make it look more Apple-ish and get the white, or just, you know, stay more traditional with the, with the black. Um, overall, I, I think it's, I think it's unique. Um, like I said, I think it's more for uh, people that want the customized phone that aren't looking for a very high-end product. Um, but... Anyway, uh, hopefully this helps you in, in deciding what phone. I, I think it looks like a good phone, the Motorola X. Um, it won't be the phone I buy, but it would be a phone that maybe it's good for my parents or uh, someone, you know, like I said, that's that not really a power user that just needs a, you know, needs a phone.